Right now, I'm probably breaking every single rule there is. I got a hat on, I have transitional glasses on, and I'm gonna share some things with you about the 2500 service body truck. No one pays for anything. Not one person really pays for anything that they don't find value in. Now, you can come in and you can see a lot of walk-arounds on a vehicle, on a 2500 HD, and can find out a lot of information. But if you don't find out why it will work for you, you don't find it why you should invest in it. And now, a service body truck, now you know it's gonna get some dings, it's gonna get some hits, it's gonna get those things. I've seen them. I've seen them when I went to Home Depot. I've been on work sites and I see people driving in trucks. They got 200,000 miles, but they look like they have been in a, in a war zone. And, and you all know that. You're, this is not something new, but you gotta know why you wanna invest in something like this. And many times, all you see is a great walk around and nobody really shares with you why this vehicle is really a great one to go. And I wanna start with the door panel itself. When you close the door, you can close it solidly. It has a solid sound. That has a long wear and tear. You know your guys and the people that work for you, they are gonna be hopping in and out closing the door. You don't hear that on many videos. People won't do that. This is how they'll close the door. You know your guys, you know your team. They're not closing doors like that. They got a bunch of equipment on trying to get out, trying to get to a site, and that's how they're closing the door. And you want to make sure that that vehicle can handle a door slam. You know your guys, you know the team. They're looking in the back. You want to make sure we do it all nice and gentle, but your team is not doing that. They're closing doors like this because they're getting their tools out. They got some things they want to get out of the vehicle. This is a solid piece. This is why I'm showing you this. This is why it's a great investment in making sure that the NAPI has what it takes to continue to make sure that it will last for your job site. Your team is not opening doors like this. That's a model. Your team is opening up doors like this. When you get to a job site, you're doing this. And you wanna make sure that can stay in place. Not only that, if you wanna take the chains off them, you wanna make sure it ain't no dents or anything gonna happen on the side of the vehicle. Napa have put rubber pieces down. I know, listen, I get it. This is a different type demonstration of the vehicle. But if you don't see the value in it, you're not gonna invest in it and you won't find out, hey, will this last my company? I'm not buying, hey, I'm not buying something that I need to replace every two years. You're buying something that you wanna last cause you have jobs and you have assignments and your team need equipment that's going to work. I'm not kidding with you. So your team wanna make sure when they're eating lunch, they're not doing like, you know, the normal walk around. Hi, you can lean on it. No, they leaning hard. They got the phone, talking on the phone, writing down some stuff, getting it down. Hey, get this over here. This is why you want to make sure the equipment is good. This is solid. I'm not joking around with you. This is solid. So it's in here. It closes. It has the lock piece even the back cover. Let's take a look at it. Plenty of room, plenty of room to put everything that you need. Again, I'm showing you reasons why to invest in this vehicle. So that's how they close the door, come on. You know they do. Having a not buy back, you know that, hey, you got plenty of friends. That's how people, that's how workers open up the door. They don't do it all nice and gentle. They're putting it down because they need to get inside. They got to put some boards back here. You got some tool boxes and you want to make sure that this is solid. I'm sharing with you these things because as a business elite leader and salesperson, I want to make sure that your team and that you know that, hey, when I invest in this equipment at Chevrolet, I got a good piece of equipment. I got a one area I wanted to mention to you that you can tow with this. I want you to see this tow hitch. It is on here. Look how stable it is. Let's take a look underneath. Yeah, you can hook up that trailer to the back of this here and still have stabilization. Has the hook up right here. See that? I got a great truck. 
but I got a good piece of equipment. I can take it on a job site. I know the guy's gonna put some dings in it. I know some things are going to happen, but it's a great vehicle. Let's take a look on the inside. The inside is just as important as the outside of the vehicle. That's because you're gonna spend a lot of time. Guys are gonna be having papers, gotta have receipts, have plans, and you wanna make sure they have plenty of room, that they are comfortable in the vehicle. This is one of the reasons I'm asking you to can really consider choosing the 2500 gas model. The model itself has room for itself, has spacing to keep the receipts have an area for business cards, or you can allow them to keep their receipts right here. Put your business cards here, but it has the spacing. If you need the space, need somebody else to sit in here, you can do so by lifting up the seat. So you do have the room where another person can ride up front because it does have a seat safety belt right here. Now I'm explaining this to you and I'm giving you a pretty thorough walk around a little different than what you ever seen before and the reason is because this is going to be part of your fleet part of your commercial who looks good feels good and has the feel the look it is the 6.6 .6. it can get in the spaces that you need it to get in because this vehicle is designed to do so this is the chevy silverado it is available I have several of them get in contact with me. I know, I broke every single rule there is for a demonstration on a vehicle. I opened the doors up, I slammed the doors, I kicked the tires, I did everything that everyone else will not do. You know why I did it? Because I know that on a job site, if your guys are like a team of people that I go around and see every day, they're gonna use this vehicle in a lot of different ways. And you wanna make sure that when they're using it, it's not gonna fall apart. It's not gonna tear down after two years. You wanna make sure not only does it get there, but your team and your crew is safe. And with the safety features that we carry on the HD, the 2500, this will be a great investment. Again, I am CJ Bryant, the fleet and commercial sales here at Jim Hudson Chevrolet. Ask me about the business elite finance programs. We have so many ways that we can help you get into this vehicle. Thank you again for watching. Like and subscribe. Do that for me. Get in contact with me. I'm CJ Bryant.